Hey, Kobe, I bet you can't. Nah, that's too easy. Watch this. I bet you can't call me, Kobe. I bet you I can, challenge is accepted. To clone you and swab your DNA, I needed to figure out exactly where you live. I zoomed into the background of your video. I see the Bellagio building in Toronto. And right there was the building that you were on top of. I took my DNA swab kit from my laboratory and headed straight to the airport. Once I arrived, I booked the last two remaining seats to Toronto, Canada. One for me and one for my cameraman. I had to get my DNA swab kit and my protective case on the plane, so I went through security. At this point, I was super scared because I didn't want want to get in trouble. With my DNA swab kit in my hand, I walk straight into the scanner. I make it out with no problems and it was time to board my flight to Toronto, Canada. I knew I might run into some problems with a DNA Q-tip in a swab container on an airplane. Every single person in this airplane was looking at me like I was crazy, but they didn't know that I had to swab DNA in Toronto, Canada. I finally get to my seat and I had a beautiful flight. Seven hours later, we land in Toronto, Canada, and it was time to find the building that you licked. Once I I was in Toronto, I took one subway, and after a 25 minute ride, I finally arrived at the building that you licked. Now, I had to figure out a way to get on the rooftop. I went inside the building and got in the elevator. I pressed the top floor. I got out and looked for the staircase. Once I found the stairs, I walked up 17 floors of stairs. To get on the outside of the roof, I had to climb up another ladder. Finally, I make it to the top and see the orange sign that you licked. I couldn't reach it, so I tied my Q-tip to a metal wire, and I swabbed your DNA directly off the orange sign and went back to my DNA laboratory to clone you. Back at my lab, that's your DNA right there. Place it inside my hydrated cylinder. I let the enzyme secrete in the DNA. This is your clone after 46 days and if everything goes correct, I will have a climber for myself. 